Hello everyone, hope you're doing well and hanging in there. Today I'm going to do a tutorial on AutoCAD, Illustrator, and Photoshop. How to do line work, how to bring it into Illustrator and change line weights, um, and also how to take hand sketches and uh, touch those up in Photoshop. So no worries if you don't have uh, some of these programs. Um, drawings that are hand-drawn are uh, anyways usually um, more evocative. All right, so let's get started in AutoCAD. You can type in properties to get that menu on the side to show up. Um, and then when you click on one of those rectangles, you can then change the line weight. And you can do that either in the left menu or above where properties is. Uh, I find it more useful and convenient to have it on the left there. Then we're going to go to print to PDF and bring it into Illustrator. So what's really cool about this is Illustrator can open up this PDF directly and you are essentially going to be looking at uh, vector line work. So you can double click any of these lines and they're active lines that you can manipulate change the stroke, change the width, uh, make it dashed, color it in, uh, etc. Okay, so now moving over to Photoshop. I did a quick diagram sketch and took a pretty crappy photo and opened it up in Photoshop. You want to make sure that you're in the Windows menu that both your layers and your adjustment layers are turned on. This is so that you can use the adjustment layers uh, as layers rather than adjusting the actual image itself. This really allows you to go back at any point and make further adjustments uh, as necessary. So you can start by adjusting the saturation and bringing that to zero and then you can open up levels and Really, you want to just try out moving these um, triangles in different ways to get it to look the best. Uh, you want to make sure that you're not blowing out the image and your line work, but that you do enough so that you get a nice white background. And you can, it's, it's really just a matter of playing around with it to get the, the right uh, ratio of that. I usually start with uh, the one that's on the furthermost right and move that in and then adjust the middle one. Great, thank you. So I hope this was useful and that you learned something. Just let me know if you have any questions and I can keep making videos. Cool, thanks, bye.